SoundCloud is a crude music platform with provocative words used commonly in the community. This film has been specially formatted for your school. Hey, what's up? It's your boy, Lil Weeks. You already know we are here at school. Hate this place, which my mama let me drop out. But anyway, we're gonna do ultimate mini Weeks in locker prank. Oh, yeah. Keeps you full, keeps you fresh. Buy mini Weeks at your local market today. We, we need to close the the locker, right, in order for it to be a prank, so uh, someone uh, will get it. Uh, you know, I actually, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna grab this, you know, this Who? it's expensive, you know, uh, you'll cut this part out, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah, yeah, don't worry about it. SoundCloud, the next step in the music industry. Vinyl, CD, radio, all its predecessors had one thing in common, genre diversity, which truly limited the style that rappers could convey. In today's soundscape on SoundCloud, however, we experience rap like never before. Without competition from other genres, we can hear rap how its founding fathers always imagined. The people behind this movie carry a weight about them. They are SoundClouds. We decided, rather than talk to established rappers about the industry, we would visit some up-and-comers and get their take on the lifestyle. Our first specimen is Lil Robot. He has a distinct sound to his music that many consider to be controversial and off-putting, but he stands by his creative choices. Yeet Esketi. Lil Robot in the house reppin' that 3-1. We out here. We out here reppin' that. My name is Lil Robot. I am on SoundCloud. SoundCloud is my life. My life is sound. Anyone who diss my new track, they wonkers dude. Europe. J Dub. One, two, three, four. I declare a gang war. Bloods v Crips, boats v ships. Cars Lil v Robot's trains, new single, Gang Wars, planes. has garnered a lot of attention for its very controversial stance on gang relations. Who? Lil Weeds has an opinion. Then I may give you the slip. Oh man, you know, Gang Wars. It's just an absolutely garbage song. You know, just like Lil Robot. Like, he doesn't use his voice, you know what I'm saying? Like, he doesn't write his music, he doesn't write his lyrics. Like, what the Frick. f you can do, dog? Like, how can you like somebody who literally doesn't do anything? Just like, who cares about it, you know? Bye, my dudes. Hi, Fiber. But there is a dark side to SoundCloud. This next rapper rose to prominence, but was chased out of the community when he was unwilling to adapt with the evolving platform. He refused to pop those zannies, as current rappers like Lil Pump say, and he also refused to say yeet and esket it when the terms rose to the forefront of the culture. We are hiding his image and voice to keep him safe from those who may want to hurt him. SoundCloud is pure toxicity. Okay, streaming is just not the answer to how music is going to evolve. It just isn't the natural progression to it. I mean, look at the way music evolved before. Before, it started with a black Frick. The tube, okay? And then, it moved on to a flat black disc with vinyl. Then it became an even smaller black disc. Then it became a little rectangle. And now, we're looking at little metal discs, okay? I mean, it just makes sense that we go back to CDs and try and find the tech from there. Like, like maybe a little triangular disc. Something like that. Alright, well, thanks guys for this video. You know, I gotta get the message out there somehow, and I appreciate the work, but you know, I'd appreciate it too if you guys can, you know, uh, have my mixtape around a little bit. You know, Fiery Fist. You know, it goes out to the kids out there, it goes out to the poor people and the kids in Africa. You know, we gotta help people out. Uh, but yeah, you know, just spread the message around, spread the mixtape around. You guys know some producers, right? Yeah? Yeah. yeah okay, okay. There we go, there we go. Okay. Thanks guys. But other members of the community look at the lighter side of the service. You know, uh, SoundCloud out here, it's important to us. We out here, uh, I'm out here in like Florida. Ooh. You know, we out here trying to get a message across. You know, I speak my music to the people through SoundCloud. And that's why it's important to me, you know. Am I right? <laughs> Wait, sorry, what's your political message here? You know, I don't really have a political message, I don't get political like that, you know. If you know me on a personal level, I don't get political like that. But, uh, this gets played because it's not my phone, and you know, if I play the song, I get more money. Let's <laughs> get it! Am I right? <laughs> One problem that is seemingly common among these lower tier artists is income. 
Rappers like Lil Wheat have turned to trying to get a corporate sponsorship in order to gain more of an income. Yeah, man. You know, I, I've decided to brand myself around the Mini Wheats Corporation. I figure, you know, if I rep them enough, you know, they'll hook me up with some of those sweet dollar bills, you know, like ka-ching, ka-ching. Am I right? So, you know, buy Mini Wheats at your local market today. You know, keeps you fresh, keeps you full. You know what I'm saying, dog? We reached out to Kellogg's Cereal on the matter. Their official statement says that they have never and will never sponsor anyone of the likes of Lil Wheats. They also said that Lil Wheats, birth name of Frederick Young Cameron, will receive a cease and desist on the use of their brand name as of immediately. How much money do you make off this Sam Hutt stuff? Well, I mean, okay, you know, it's, it's not really about the money, you know what I'm saying? Like. Like, it's just not, it's not about that. It's about the message and the music and, like, the fans. You know what I'm saying? So, so I'm, I'm guessing not an awful lot then? All right, so this is just a little something I've been working on. It's my latest track. I'm going to play it for you guys. I think you're really going to enjoy it. Just a little sneak peek of Lil Wheats in action, you know? What, cash. mom? I don't have your cash, okay, mom? I know you have it. Why would Why it? would I have? Because you've cash? been taking my cash every time you make one of your silly songs. Okay, look, okay, look, it, we're filming a music video, and it just it just it blew away it in the wind. Okay, it blew it away. It blew away. Yeah, it blew away. What do you mean it blew away? I mean, so you can't I mean, pay me back. I mean, it blew away, so mom. So you can't pay me back. I can you pay you back. If you let me drop out of school so I can focus on my, my dream. I'm not going to let you drop out of school. You're a smart young kid. You should become an architect like your grandfather. I don't want to be an architect like grandpa. That's gay. Don't say that in my house. I'm, I'm going to say that. You have two mom. mothers. Mom. You know you mom. live in a family mom. with gay people. Mom, they're, they're filming. I'm trying to be cool. You can't. Mom. How come when the cameras turn on? You become a rude, mom, obnoxious, stupid stop, person. Mom, stop it! The filming! I don't want to build buildings, mom! You, you can't build buildings, because you're weak. You should design them, you little... Female dog. That should be a stupid rat name, little... Female dog. I hate you! I wish you were a dog! How, how, how could you say that? <laughs> you know, I, I found a five-dollar bill. On the like the ground yesterday, that was pretty. That was pretty dope. And like, oh, um, gotten a few like pennies here and there. Uh, it, it, you, you win some, you lose some, you know. So yeah, I guess that's nothing really. Lil Robot looks up to Lil Big Pump as his idol. He credits LBP as the reason he got into SoundCloud in the first place. We have arranged for him to meet his idol. Yo, man, I'm so hyped to see Lil Big Pump, dude. I just, like, he's my idol. You know what I'm saying? My idol. I look up to him. It's gonna be good. You know, I got him some coffee. See what happens, you know. Maybe I could get on a track with him. We'll see. It's gonna be good. Alright, this is the door up here on the left. Oh. Thanks. It's hard to see in this helmet. Hi. You know what? I make music. Little robot can make music. Little robot carbon. <laughs> Dude, what the hell, man? Like, your music. It's nasty ass. Ah, it's straight up boink. Bro. I thought we were chill, man. Like, I thought we were like, do a track together. Like, Big man now with our helmet and silly boy. <laughs> There's only one way we can fail it. A rap battle. <laughs> Fred. Do it. do it. Female dog. Wow, wow. Oh, dude. Mono, mono. We'll see who they're doing. Who? Mono, a goddamn mono. That's a little it's big pump. Fred. Okay. Little robot, little robot. No grill. That's how we do it. Mm, 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 mm. I'll fight you like an 
Snapple. Flip you up, twist you upside down like the inside of the cap of a Snapple. A, 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 uh, little robot, gunshot, grape shot, what not, what, what, you're dead. Mm. Wanna hop on that mic? I hop the bro. I spin that Who? Your style is flow. I got that Who? One, two, three. I'm on the beat like Johnny and me and in the car. Drive so far. And your hair is pink. And your shirt is colors. And your pants are brown. Your shoes. Mini wee. Uh, uh, I got red. We got beat. That's how it is. It's meat sandwich. Uh, uh, it's a meat sandwich. Your buns, her buns, I meant. Uh, I get it, I get it, I get it. I got a high school diploma. I get it, I get it. What you got? That's what I thought. Yeah, I dropped out of school. That ain't cool. You know, you used to be our idol. I used to look up to you, but now I hate you more than I hate the blacks. Wait. What? What? I didn't mean that, man. Sorry. It's just, you know, it's like rapping, dude. Frick. My mom was like that. Frick.